The last Deadman tournament was my best ever. After a week of solid grinding, I managed to achieve max stats and nearly max gear for a tank. But that's not all. For the entire week, I had been part of the Shiloh Village lockdown, stopping everybody else from getting Vengeance, Dragon Slayer 2, and most importantly, Piety done. The battles were intense, but the wall was never broken. I'd never been more prepared to step up on stage and take the win live in front of thousands of people. I made it through multi with these. This was going to be the pinnacle of my dead man career. Yeah, it was pretty sad. However, today Jagex are hosting the rerun for the Fallen, justice for the Falador Warriors. Everybody that got into the 1v1s will be able to take part in the 1v1 bracket. And what's even better is it's for the full prize money. Solar mission, wake up, wake up, it's Black Alert! Black Alert! What do you want? There's 200 hashtag alliance people running at the cave right now, they're gonna get Shiloh Village done! Yeah, but we can't do anything about it, because Jagex disabled PvP. So that's it then, thousands of hours of work to gain an advantage in a competitive tournament is all gonna be undone, and everyone's gonna get piety for free. I didn't say anything about piety! <laughs> So the plan was we were going to kill the dwarves as part of the one small favour quest and as soon as they respawned we were going to kill them again and again and again and again and again so nobody could complete the quest. Well it wasn't exactly foolproof, there is a way to get through that but we weren't sure that people would be able to figure it out in time. But in the end it did not matter as Jagex decided to give everyone free piety once again disabling PvP everywhere, they just made it so when you talk to the NPC you get that quest step unlocked. So yeah, maybe I shouldn't make intros before I actually play the final hour. So yeah, while everyone was maxing out and everything, I didn't really have anything to do as I'd actually done it all in the week. So I had a bit of a chill three hours. So I've come to Black Dragon just because I have the chance of getting a VLS, getting a Visage here as well. The drop rate is boosted in Deadman mode, so I might be able to get something. And I've hit like nothing. Five hits in a row. Maybe this is quite bad. Look how dumb this is. I look like the biggest feast in the entire world. He just run around with no PvP anywhere. Loving life right now. Boys, multi is back on. North of Falador. I'm gonna die again. I don't know why. No one knows what's going on. It's absolute chaos. Okay, so this is my final hour gear. I've managed to get it all back and I've got all my potions and everything. Looking pretty good. I really could do with getting a DFS or a VLS because stat hammer. It can be a bit unreliable. If I get the specs off, hopefully I should be able to kill some of the VLS. Obviously I've got the tank plate and legs for fighting tanks and switching between the skirt for brids. Hopefully this goes okay. It is the start of the three hours right now, so I'm just sorting out my bank, making sure I definitely do have everything. Hopefully it all goes well. Living in New Orleans, she came in from Texas. Every local show I put her name on the guest list, but I don't never see her. I've came to expect this. She would rather chill at the crib watching Netflix. Um, not trying to sound pretentious, but most girls would say she sounds senseless. I guess cause I don't drive in a Lexus. You prefer the guy who would buy you a necklace. I'll take you out to dinner and not hung over breakfast. Oh, I get this, it would all sound senseless. If you told your mom she'd been loved. I'm 21, about to be 22 Not trying to turn 30, regret what I didn't do When I was coming up on this music and still in school Cause honestly, I'm living my dream and I've been a fool So, whether or not you would like to partake At least give it just one night for our sake I'm part Johnny Cash, part Lennon and part Drake I'll sing a love song, but I'll leave you a heartache Yeah, yeah, these other girls never seem to mind Like, have you seen the line? <laughs> just joking I Honestly, I wrote this I know how to get out And I'll 
all fine by my way, cuz, cuz it's love, real simple, and that's how it works, oh, so won't you just give it up, cuz you don't understand, big it up, but you don't understand, and it's really nice, but you don't understand, so big it up, cuz you don't understand, this, you don't understand, baby, being real danger, this world ain't simple, but I'm strong, I know how to get out. Cause it's love, real simple, and that's how it works. Oh, oh. it's not fear, real danger. But this world ain't simple, but I'm strong, I know how to get out. And I'll find my way, cuz, cause it's love, real simple, and that's how it works. Oh, oh. so won't you just give it up, cause you don't understand. Big it up, but you don't understand. This world ain't simple, but I'm strong, I know how to get out. And I'll find my way, cuz, cuz it's love, real simple, and that's how it works. Oh, oh. Ah, oh, that's unfortunate. What the hell? I thought I hit quite a lot there. Oh well. What can you do? So yeah, I ended up losing to the guy that came second overall in the tournament. Unfortunately, this guy was one of the people that just got given piety for free. And it, I'm not going to lie, I am a little bit annoyed because I thought this was supposed to be a rerun. I died to the gas in Fally and... All of a sudden, in the supposed rerun, I've had my entire advantage erased. I would have had piety on this guy. I lost by 50 HP. I think I could have performed a lot better personally, but what can you do? Under the pressure, you don't always do your best, do you? One good thing was I actually got featured on the Old School RuneScape stream. Big shout out to Rixie, Pure Spam, and Nintonisa for casting the event. I think they did an amazing job. And also, brilliant news, my man Bellis, a member of Blazers, which I'm also a member of, took home the 20k, took home the win. And big shout out as well to another Blazers member called Aiden, who also finished in the top three. So although I'm a little bit salty, and you can call me a crybaby, whatever, overall, the result is really good. Those guys absolutely smashed it. And it was so hype watching the final fights in TeamSpeak. Anyway, the next Deadman Mode tournament and the last Deadman tournament ever will be starting on the 22nd of June, which is next week. It's next Saturday. I am so hyped. It's the last one ever. I'm going to go super hard. I love playing the Deadman Mode tournament. So if you want to be around for that, make sure you subscribe. Drop a little cheeky like as well if you enjoyed this video. I didn't win any money, unfortunately. But yeah, at least I made top 32, I guess. I might take a little bit of a break before dead my mode because I always go super hard and grease out for it. So, so I hope you guys have a nice week and I'll probably see you with a dead man video in a bit. <laughs>